for a long time so I decided that I should get back into it um, I started with trying to do some drawings but then I thought of maybe doing a painting for my room and to decorate it and I decided to use a sakura tree a Japanese um, cherry tree because I find them the most beautiful trees out of all of them and we are currently growing one as well hi guys my name is Shepard and I am 13 years old and my video is going to show you how to paint with acrylic then what I did was get some yellow paint and dab do it with a sponge and to make it like a grass effect and let that dry then what I did was get some brown paint and draw, drew some branches I got some sponge and some yellow paint and mixed a bit like a tiny little bit of brown paint into it and dabbed that on there then I got some brown paint and dabbed a little bit of brown paint on there as well so it does like look like a proper tree then I covered some um, the the tree and the moon and the um, grass with some paper because we're gonna draw like stars so the white paint doesn't go on there then I got some white paint and a brush and I just flickered some like like that flicked some white paint onto it then it will look like stars and this is what it looks like at the end thank you guys for watching Hi, my creative activity this week is art and I'm doing monoprinting for my college work. Monoprinting is a technique where you get ink like this and roll it onto cardboard or any flat surface like this is what we're given at college. Um, then you can choose a picture you want to print like uh, I chose this tree that's in the nighttime because my theme is light and dark but you can choose anything. Uh, you put it on top of a blank piece of paper like this and then obviously sour tape it down so it doesn't move and then after that you just need to go over the picture with like a pen and then just like drawing over all the parts that you want to and then after that you can take off the picture and the picture will be printed onto the inky paper um, 